Hello again. In just a few years, about $29 trillion were printed or spent in various different ways in the USA alone just to bail out banks. They were bailed out because they were considered too big to fail. But more than 400 banks needed this treatment. They did eventually fail and were swallowed up by just four super banks. Now these four super banks are simply too big to bail. So before they were big enough to even allow them to fail, now they're too big because nobody has the money to print or conjure up in order to bail them. This is why all the rule changes that governments have been making over the past few years are to make sure that the banking system does not collapse but at the receiving end of it is always the taxpayer, the small depositor, the consumer, who is ultimately the one to foot the bill. The governments mismanage public funds. They misspend them on adventures and wars and aggression towards other nations, on defense budgets that are needless in many cases. And the public always pays the price. And this is why the banking system is designed to work together with those in power, those in government, but never in favor of the people. Please watch the next video.